Hey guys, so I know it's a little late, but this is my attempt at the Blake Lively Met Gala look. So I started out with the MAC Strobe Cream in Pink Light, and then I'm using the Hourglass Spanish Stick Foundation all over my skin. I'm in the shade Linen, and yeah, I'm just applying it using my Rimmel Beauty Sponge, and it is dip. So then for brows, I'm using the Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil in shade 3. So I used the spoolie first and then I just started to fill them in. Um, mine were a little bit more structured than Blake's were. Her brows are like beautiful and bushy on their own. Mine aren't so much, but I tried my best. So I just spoolied them up again and then used a little bit of Gimme Brow in shade 1 just to make them look a little bit more fluffier and fuller. Then moving on to eyeshadows, I'm priming my lids using Tarte Shape Tape and I'm just blending it out using the same sponge I used for my foundation. And then going in to the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk palette, I'm taking that bony kind of shade and just applying it all over the lids. Then I'm using this shade, I think it's called Eden, I'm not 100% sure of the names of these, but I'm just buffing this into the crease quite messily with an E40. And then taking the shade next to it, which is much more of a warm toned, deeper brown, I'm just doing the same thing. Then I'm taking the shade Saffron on an E25 from Sigma, and I'm really like packing this on in the outer corner and then bringing it up through the crease, just keeping it really smoky and buffed out. And I'm taking my E40 once again just to blend. And then I took my highlighter palette from Mecca. And I tried to apply this to the lid, but it seriously was not pigmented enough for an eyeshadow or wasn't happy with it. So I then sprayed my brush with some Fix Plus, ugh, Fix Plus Pink Light. And then I took the shade Nefreti from Nefret. Oh my gosh, I don't know how to say that. But it's like this golden shade. I applied it to my lids and then I took this ColourPop shadow, which is much more of like a glittery, glowing shadow. It looks absolutely beautiful. I applied that to the lids with my fingers, then blended and added some more saffron just to build up the intensity. Then I'm going in with my black coal liner and I'm just applying that in my tight line and then I'm applying a messy line to my upper lash line and then I'm using a little smudger on the end just to really smudge that into my lashes. Then I applied a coat of Benefit Bad Girl Bang mascara and then I applied the Kiss Blooming Lashes. I forget what style, I think they're peony, but I applied those to my eyelids. Then moving back to the face, I am concealing and highlighting using Tarte Shape Tape again. This one's in Fair Neutral, which is my lighter shade, um, and then I just blended everything out using the same sponge from before, and you can really kind of sharpen up your outer edge of the eyeshadow when you do this, just kind of, yeah, drag it along and keep it nice and neat. And then I set that concealer with MAC Fix, no, what am I saying? MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural in Light Plus. And I just used an F35 from Sigma. Then to bronze up my skin and contour, I used NARS Laguna Bronzer. It's in a limited edition palette, but it is literally just NARS Laguna, the same as you can buy individually. So I just applied that to my cheekbones, my forehead, temples, and underneath my chin. Then for blush, I used NARS Gilda Blush, which is this matte golden, gold, blah. guys, I'm struggling, I'm so sorry. It's like a corally shade. And then I took the same highlighter palette from earlier, and I used the shade on the far left just to highlight my skin really intensely, pretty much. Um, yeah, I just highlighted in all the areas where I would normally highlight. And then to set everything down and keep my powders nice and dewy, I used MAC Fix Plus Pink Light. And then back onto the under eyes, I used Saffron again and I really buffed this under the lower lash line. Blake's look was very burgundy and smoky. Um, and then I used that ColourPop shade on my pinky, just applied that to the inner corners and the inner third of my lower lash line. And then I used a bronzy pencil in the waterline from Models Prefer and then applied some lower lash line. I mean, oh my gosh, lower lash mascara. I'm a mess. And then finally for lips, I used this plummy kind of lip liner from Tarte. 
which did crumble on me and <laughs> I always have to include that because it happens to me all the time. So I just outlined my lips and then I filled them in with this tart lipstick which is this bright fuchsia kind of colour. Blake's colour was a bit more burgundy but I didn't have a shade that matched. So this was close enough and then I did blot my lips because her lips were quite muted and that completes the look. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you in my next video.